Good afternoon, good morning, good evening from wherever you are across the globe. We are represented in 212 countries on passive is everywhere on the globe at this present time. Right now, I am coming to you from Papua New Guinea, live from my uh, hamlet in Turubu, Wewak district in Isipik province. I'd like to just welcome everyone who is here this afternoon around the globe. Thank you, my uh, friends from around the globe. We have Lynn, thank you Lynn for uh, co-hosting this uh, meeting with us. Thank you, Mati De Gamo, my brother from another mother. He's not feeling sick today. Uh, he's feeling a little bit uh, sick today. So we want to uh, wish you a speedy recovery, health. We send our prayers and love to you, Mati, and your family. Papua New Guinea is your family, my brother. So uh, we are with you and we know we're gonna uh, transmit this positive energy to you and you get well, brother. And uh, I see Tony Monk here. Thank you, Tony, he's always here. So send our prayer and a healing uh, energy to your friend there. Also your partner, thank you for your presence. And we welcome all the other founder family around the globe. And in Papua New Guinea, we are in 22 provinces. Thank you. You plow together, stop long Papua New Guinea, one map you stop long M in Atap Long Highlands, Long Momaste, Long Southern Region, Long New Guinea Islands. We welcome you plow Lord Isla Abinu time. Name Lomi me David Bakao. I uh, suppose you plow not clear. Um, this is a business on passive. Um, one plow information technology company. And we no launch yet. Close to time by me launch. So me plow share him this la information one time you. This la company me plow close share him. In a person close to three plow year now in Charlo PNG since 2019. Time uh, me kiss him this la business coming chat. And my name me introduce him to this la business. Name long name Mati Digamong. So me like welcome you Upla, Upla, Upla line, Upla all guest. Uh, Upla can sit down easy, na look, look, na hard and want him something, Upla talk, talk, talk. Suppose you got question behind, you can ask him question. And time to you, me, Papua New Guinea. So no can for it, no can same. One him can ask him you got. Suppose you pili must say, me no good, ask him, you ask him, that's all. You know, got one plus ask him, I'm no good. Or got to ask him, I'm good, pla. Blow help him, you, na me, some pla by for it, lo, Ask him slow one kind of question, I'll hold him, hold him, stop. So you ask him now and by clear him head, blow me, blow that. Thank you. So you plus sit down, you see one time me, now me plus can go back and uh, start him slow program. Thank you, Lynn. Um, I've just uh, welcomed everybody, introduced uh, the business to our people in Papua New Guinea. Yes, and uh, I just want to um, make sure that we all understand this uh, uh, company. It's a global company started by our uh, wonderful CEO, a man uh, with the heart of uh, humanity, you know, he's got the heart that is uh, uh, like Mother Teresa's heart. And he has created this platform for us so that we can become 1 million Mother Teresa's around the globe and uh, sharing and uplifting humanity. So thank you, Lynn, over to you. If you have uh, something to show us this afternoon, you can yes. go ahead. Yes, David, we do have, thank you for the introduction, awesome. We have a good agenda plan today for all of you. We're, what we're gonna do is we're gonna begin with a recording of Mr. Ash Mofara. Mr. Ash Mofara visited Friday night live on June 3rd, two days ago, no, right, sorry, sorry, three days ago. So we were blessed by his presence and he spoke for about half an hour, I think 29 minutes or so. And he was very busy, but he spent that those precious 30 minutes with us. So we're gonna play the recording of him speaking with us. And then we're gonna go into uh, a presentation by OTech Pro's Collins Mana. Collins is gonna represent the group of four tonight. Thank Collins, we appreciate it. It's, it's 5.30 a.m. for Collins in UK. So you can see his dedication and commitment to PNG. We really thank you Collins for that. You have a heart for us. So thank he's gonna be talking about Final, thank you, Collins. Final steps to the market, and he'll be covering uh, quite a wide range of topics. He'll be talking about the 
software development using the Agile Scrum framework. And he'll be talking a little bit about security. He'll talk about compliance and also laser technology, which is very exciting. Laser technology is now in our data center. So this is something that we all would like to learn. It's exciting. So he'll be going over that. And when that's done, we'll go into a question and answer. We want to emphasize that this webinar is a PNG webinar. We want to focus on the PNG people. So we PNG folks, we want to give you the priority to be asking questions. And this is why we have this webinar in the first place. So let's, our international audience, we do love you and appreciate you, but let's give priority to the PNG people, all right? So PNG people, come on over to the panel. If there are any of you still sitting in the attendees list, please come on over. Co-hosts help me to invite them over to the panel. Thank you very much. Now we're going to go into the recording of Mr. Ash Mofara speaking. Enjoy it. It was really lovely. He spoke from his heart. So let me share my screen. <laughs> Okay, boss man, talk, talk. Boss man's gonna talk. Exactly. All right. Are you ready for Ashmo Farah's speech? I mean, his sharing is lovely. It's really lovely. Hold on one second. Let me. David, if you can mute on your end, we hear your um, your background sound. Hope you're doing great. Good evening, sir. Thank you uh, for all the great information. I did uh, listen to uh, Collins' uh, part. Is it Collins with an S or Colin? No, S or no? Collins with an S. Mm -hmm. Because that's how you spell it. Most people call you Colin. Let's make a correction, it's everybody. Collins. He's Collins. Okay. That's what I thought. Uh, you are a scrum master, no doubt. Absolutely. No wonder. Uh, so uh, I was uh, really thrilled in, on how you broke down the, the framework and uh, you, you have been that, that uh, direction for sure. Like, you know, this is exactly how we're doing. it. Uh, and I agree with you. I did listen partially to uh, Oliver and uh, I hope everything is okay with Vincent. And uh, definitely I'll catch up with Bob's. I, I got, you know, a little bit in and out. Uh, I have something called family and, you know, sometimes they take your time, but uh, I will uh, catch the recording. I wouldn't miss this. Uh, as uh, I think, Lynn, you are an educator, like you have a master's degree and uh, I, I believe. In Lynn, education, my, yeah, in education, yes. my field is uh, counseling, working with the deaf working with university level students and working with the disabled. Mm -hmm. So in colleges and universities, you know, there is like, especially the American system, we have uh, credits and, and hours, you know, each course topic subject has certain amount of hours. Sometimes uh, what you're allowed to take in a, in, a, in a term, let's say 15, 18, the average, and uh, sometimes uh, on your uh, subject of, of study, let's say your major, you don't have enough credits available that fits your schedule. So what you do is you, call, you take something called elective mm -hmm. topics. And those are, to me, are complete waste. Uh, somebody's studying, let's say, medical or uh, computer engineering, and, and they go and take American history or, uh, you know, religious studies or in international politics, art, something completely will not be used in their career. So they will spend four months term listening to that, spending money, time, energy, and we call it elective, but they take it. I don't know why we have it. Uh, but this is elective, as Lynn said, and I 
really want to thank her and all the uh, volunteers with uh, Ron Albert and uh, all the supporters who attend Find the Time on Friday night. Uh, it is uh, really elective, okay? Yes. Nobody has to come here. The difference between traditional education and, and this, this is number one, desirable. This is related to our life and it matters. And uh, most importantly, we don't have to pass. There's no tests or grading. Listen, get as much as you can. If you don't get it, not going to be punished or penetrated, um, not in any way or uh, uh, like uh, penalized or anything. So you are going to be completely fine uh, if you don't get it. Uh, okay, this is completely volunteered uh session i believe from all of us and i think they are doing outstanding work we are fortunate to have you so uh i get a lot of uh insights and i uh i think it's a good bridge between hardcore uh technical computer terms and then everyday life for average people play english mm -hmm. that's a good thing so that's why i, I kind of it's important to me and you know how passionate we are about technology so i do uh really get a good vibe uh, coming here so that's why even sometimes i'm not planning to come i find it i just want to come and show my support and my gratitude uh it is quite uh helpful and uh thank you for all what you do and i hope uh you know we continue this this is definitely uh free education for all of us and you don't have to pass no no uh no punishment no penalty no no failing no passing it's you get what you get uh so going back to uh william i think uh in l l let me break it down if you want to connect the two there's something called fiber optic okay in internet connectivity or they are literally pipes okay and uh, the material the form is glass believe it or not, glass, okay? Uh, and uh, that's what trans transmits and in, uh, transforms uh, information, data, okay? Uh, so the bandwidth or what's being uh, transformed, okay, be uh, uh, transferred between uh, machines has to go through connections. It doesn't fly, even if it's called uh, cloud, still has to be stored on actual physical servers still has to be uh, uh transferred through and, and it, it travels through those fiber optic uh pipes and, and wires of course however you want to call them now the laser part is for the testing okay it is not uh it is not for the data uh trans transfer it is for testing so the test has to go through ahead you have to do the ping ahead of the data and do the connection once you do, do that then you start uh, so the laser take it for speed and the other one is for now future okay and i saw lynn nakamoto posted that uh, a good uh, two minute video about the uh laser optic okay or it's the the future of the optic uh, optical uh, data. So, meaning it's for more for, for the visual. So it will it will be faster. It will be uh, uh, more uh, dynamic. Okay, when it's uh, used through that uh, laser uh, connectivity, and it can you know go back and forth between uh, the, the sender, the recipient, the satellites, and different components and all that. It has done, and it's probably eventually you know it can be cheaper. Okay, so. Uh, those are the uh, the uses of laser. We don't want to overanalyze things. Sometimes, you know, sometimes it's a it's a supplement. Sometimes it's a it's an initial thought uh, and uh, idea that you know we are going to continue building on that. But as you heard uh, uh, Collins in the beginning, uh, he was telling you about all the different elements of our business. So sometimes I think these guys uh, god be with you because it's hard to pick when you're going to talk about data center you're going to talk about the products themselves you're going to talk about the uh, uh, networking 
aspect of it, whether it's, uh, uh, you know, the, the servers and the, uh, or the design, the framework of it, just like today, the security, blockchain, laser, this, that, there's so many terms involved. And the good news, this is elective class. You don't have to pass, you don't have to have any test. So uh, just, just sit down and relax and enjoy that. I do appreciate that Lynn and Ron took uh, the initiative to create such a culture. Uh, it is, to me, it's more important, but I, I don't want to push something that might not be as friendly or uh, practical for the masses. Maybe just a few of us, uh, a few of us enjoy the topic. So continue that. I'm, I'm a fan. I will always try to find a time and come uh, hello or, you know, answer some questions or interact with the engineers. Uh, but definitely this is a uh, something uh, it's refreshing to see people who who get it uh we uh we did nothing short of a phenomenon i mean it's mad though, the way we did it if i calculate we don't have to talk now but uh, one day after we close the founder's position we can talk about how insanely fast we were able to accomplish this yeah. even a fraction of what you know uh, so the framework is is critical in how you do things, but also the other creative elements in your, uh, uh, say, management and leadership style and how you're able to put people. To, remember, we're not an existing company. We are a startup company. We're being built from the ground up, still literally recruiting our staff. We're not done yet. We are moving with co-founders, with de developing the products, physical products, factories, data centers, everything is moving. There's so many major, major projects. And now I think we are going to be freed. Uh, pay attention to all those who do the live streams, you know, whether Red and uh, Jeffrey is doing a great job now to break things down or maybe package them, you know, in a in a shorter version instead of a longer hour. Uh, Mari Di Garmo, obviously Red is, I heard him saying he's going to be doing one a day. That's a big commitment, okay? Uh, it's uh, something, you know, we uh, owe it to him. So we will continue to listen and try to observe more and more um, of this, uh, uh, you know, uh, evolution and how we're uh, transitioning to the next uh, phase. Perhaps uh, we will be able to share things that uh, we couldn't while we are still accepting founders. So when, once we stop accepting founders, it will give us the ability to share the unshared uh, from before. That's all I wanted to say for now. Uh, I have uh, people waiting on me, but uh, I'll be happy to address one quick thing. Uh, Lynn, if you have anything you wished I uh, could touch, uh, or we can do that next sure. uh, time. Sure. Yeah, I'd like to give Bob and Colin the uh, one question each, if you don't mind, because you know there's sure. the techie guys, and there's always something they want to know. So I know they okay. have something to ask you, if you don't mind. Absolutely. Colin, Bob. Uh, yeah. <clears throat> I, okay. Hi, Bob. Hi. Hi. How you doing, Ash? Fantastic. Yeah. <clears throat> thank you. Um, when I listen to um, connect the auto translator feature, right? I got it wrong. The, first, mm. the way I got it, I got it wrong. I thought it was, uh, you know, the translation was actually happening in real time and then voice at the other end. Mm. I got it wrong. Mm. Is that something that could be in the future? Is that something that is in our So you're talking uh, about translating? Yes. So for, for all connect, for all connect. Yeah. So for now, let's talk about only CC, okay, in real time. Okay, uh, closed caption. Okay, so it's not a physical. Okay, yes. so that's an initial uh, ambition we have. It's not done. Okay, second ambition, uh, Lynn Nakamoto. I think you're going to be happy. But we will see. I'm sure we're going to pick your brain and use your expertise on the topic, uh, which is uh, we're going to try to see if we're able to develop a uh, robot shape like you know, a chat bot, but an actual figure, okay, that represent us, you know, cartoonish could be, or robotic, uh, male, female, that will be doing 
the sign language, if we're able to have a universal language, because it's, it, it varies from a culture to culture, uh, country to country. So uh, if we're able to have one standardized uh, uh, sign language that the robot, so the, the, the textual format is something, but if we're able to animate it with a robot that will be doing the sign, that is also futuristic, okay? Uh, you know, we, we just don't wanna uh, move on too, too fast, like talk ahead of the game. Uh, so let it, uh, let it, you know, one, one thing at a time, let's uh, bring up uh, O-Connect, enjoy it. Uh, you know, obviously there are many phases along the way, and then, you know, we're going all the way with this uh, technology. It's not like we're going to stop after we release uh, O-Connect the market. So wherever there is a value, especially with O-Academy, if you're able to teach Japanese and somebody in Germany has no clue uh, what they're saying in uh, in Cameroon and French or Senegal and and it, it just will connect the whole world together. I don't think there is any problem of doing it technically. Just you need the time, the effort, and the uh, determination. Uh, but it will take. Uh, so what? Uh, you know, all good things take time. Take time. Yeah. 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 It's, uh, we're going to be breathing. I I don't think there's any pressure on us. It's not a matter of existence. I feel with those scientists who had to create the vaccine for COVID-19, like now, 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 because people are dying, okay, versus this is a different uh, uh, priority versus, you know, something will ease our life and improve it. It doesn't, uh, it's not it's like life-threatening. Yes. Yeah. yeah. Hit me. <laughs> you or Oliver, anyone? Uh, uh, just yeah. one more thing. Yeah. So this call is yeah. Uh, just a question because we just talked about touch about academy, and I had this discussion with Oliver because we've done presentation and we talk about academy, but it's about certification because if we look at the other platform, what they can give is certificate of attendance, and the certificate of attendance is worthless. So is this something that Academy is looking at? So for instance, if we have Academy, you go online and you take a study someone in Africa or Asia who doesn't have money to go to a certain location to sit for the exam. Is this something that, I know it's not now, it's something that you are thinking that they can bring the portal where they can take their study and then have that certificate that's, which is accredited and internationally recognized because yes yes we're working on that right now yes okay wow yeah even right. even masters and phds not even bachelors masters and phds in that business that... <laughs> in finance in it and uh, health management wow wow journalism wow. yeah media that is a very... i'm sorry not journalism media so yeah. we, like all forms of media especially digital media so yeah we are I think we're going to be the better form of universities. Wow, wow, wow. This will be a game changer. I, I hope okay. all the And you touched upon, uh, I'm not sure, uh, Jeffrey talked about meta metaverse, like he brought up, I think, yesterday or the day before. Uh, if, if we succeed, I'm not saying we're there. If we succeed to uh, develop a good uh, metaverse for you know, let's say the uh, School of Health for uh, the dentist that, you know, the top doctors with us, okay, they're anxiously uh, excited about this. So if we succeed to go that direction and uh, bring it up uh, and integrate this with the uh, uh, OCAD, you can have, you can train technicians, okay? You can literally, uh, any career, profession, uh, even we can, uh, allow me to say it, uh, you know, penetrate the, uh, the medical field and uh, even you can, you can train, like it's like a stimulator, like a, a, uh, how do you call it? Uh, yeah, like a stimulation of a, a robot or a, 
uh, skyrocket or mm. so there's no stop it now if we're able to okay we're not there yet but knowing our optimism and uh, excitement and we're not lazy we're not afraid to venture uh we will definitely go that direction but when when we get there the that i mean i don't know schools should just uh give them to homeless people and have a good meal this is mind-blowing yeah. as just said i hope the founders those who are thinking and those who are online please listen to this and digest it it's crazy the hundreds and hundreds of thousands of school fees will disappear because you can see it in the comfort we know how much we are paid sometimes we go to all these online you know all the online study application we study they give you certificate of attendance which is worthless we have to go and pay extra money to get certification again i'm i'm gonna online. even comfort you with one thing not even to get to the metaverse let's go back up a little bit just to talk about the certificates okay so let's say uh we're gonna launch we're gonna have a building it is where the teachers are on passive teachers okay some of them will teach virtual okay doctors masters okay some of the like you know from their own home some of them or different location of one past some of them come to the actual physical university okay mm -hmm. so they will come there and uh, uh you know you'll take class but let's say let's say somebody in uh in uh Aben, okay or guatemala they don't have the ability to travel let's say to get a canadian or british uh reputable degree they will stay where they are home cut the uh, travel cost the you know uh regulations or uh, logistics uh uh boundaries or barriers such as uh visas all of that and uh, uh travel restrictions and all so they stay where they are the university accreditation is in the us or europe or any any good uh, university the middle east or asia singapore and uh you finish your class faster because you don't have to commute you don't have to do that uh let's say you get an mba typically how much would it cost you i mean it could you know with the cost of living campus all of that it could go 50 60 000, depending on where and all that okay but it's tens of thousands it's not going to be depending on where you go if you're able to get that for a couple of thousands how much you've saved the the teachers are still you know being able to make it so saving time and and instead of like three four years okay you can get that in a matter of months if you're able to focus you could even uh, have two masters at the same time you have a master and a followed with a phd or at least a bachelor's degree it, it just it will open a whole new uh uh possibility for those who are interested in degrees and why not you know to to have a, a I, you know, most of us uh, or the, the future uh, students to learn something about technology. You can, you will have work until you die. No, no doubt. You just get a degree as the access to the field and get that first career. And then once you develop, hey, on passive, we'll always be looking for sharp people with talent. So if you're able to save time and while you're being a student in Academy, you will make up times there's a possibility make up make up more money even while you're a student walk away with a degree and a business and and you know a kind of a, a solid sustainable income uh, i don't know uh it, it's hard to uh to to envision people will still go and be be like a local co community or uh two three years just to get a an associate degree and it doesn't pay well 
you know, no matter what field, with the hasp, with the cost, and all of the examinations and all. So it it just, I think we're going to remake and remanufacture uh, the educational system and the education system. Uh, you know, not. Uh, thrilled about what's in there, but we can pick what's working. All in all, I think we're already working on that as we speak. We are working on degrees uh, and uh, we are uh, speaking with the uh, professors and it's on, it's on the work as we talk. That's my word. I'm talking publicly now. So, so you will be able, but also there are, um, some affiliation so in the future there will be an affiliation between so and so university and academy on passive academy slash university where if you do this is kind of equivalent okay that also will open uh, doors now go back uh, with the with the tools and the system uh, go back if you're able to also acquire and this is not ready, it will not be ready this year for sure, but we are ambitious. If you, if some in the future, if you're able to uh, complete different language, you're able to cut that barrier and start, uh, you know, a, a new degree in a different language. So let's say your main language is English, and uh, you happen to uh, admire a Malaysian uh, university. Okay, and uh, it's uh, it's it's a different language. Up until on passive, it's impossible. How could you learn in a different language and still succeed? Not going to be okay. It's possible, and trust me, our work. And what what I gave away, it wasn't an example. It was a real thing that is happening. Mr. Ash, is, is there a uh, an unpassive system, I mean, a straight up program in place, like a course? Some, oh, some... yeah, that's beautiful. I, I will give that for free. I, I don't think I'm in, yeah, I might, uh, uh, you know, like what we're doing now, if I if I get your point, yeah, so we can give the on passive education, okay, uh, whether the business model, the financial model, or the yes, technical so. model, yeah, of course, different products. Uh, yeah, I, up until now, um, I think, think I'm, not, I'm not sharp enough to make it a business, okay, uh, others would yell at me, and, uh, so far, I thought, like, you know, make it transparent, just open source. Everybody okay. can give that knowledge. Why not? But before I go uh, and uh, I just want to say the, the data center, which is potentially going to be all the connections are ready by the end of day tomorrow. OK, we're going to have to mention the, di uh, the time zone. Uh, we're on track live on Monday and start migrating our um, hybrid uh, uh, first development. Like I said, we finish the development. Once we stabilize it, have enough servers, we go to the, the production. And you can break down the difference for the audience, the difference between development and uh, the production environment. Mm -hmm. And then, uh, you know, I think uh, Colin also mentioned that in the past. He showed some, uh, but just, just in plain English. Uh, so we will start moving the development part of Unpassive products on Monday. Everything is on track. Uh, and uh, also we, it, it is mandatory to have a minimum of uh, two internet connections. And those are live and, and they're working perfectly fine. Uh, so that's where also the laser component. So we have primary connection. If it fails, if it's sketchy, if something we have to care for, uh, there's a second one that will take over hybrid. 
and so forth. So I don't know, of course, we're talking about generators. You understand the importance of having uh, light. Uh, of course, the place is important where we take it. It's not, we don't want to go where the power goes off. Uh, so uh, we hope that we will be able to have like a 100% uptime, if not like the 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 worst it would be just very close to that it's above 99.999 so the uh, uh backup whether it's power whether it's internet one fails you don't go down you're not going to feel a blue nothing we don't go down so that's already done everything is live and i see the screens and it's beautiful everything is uh, as beautiful we probably touch up on that on a monday if we have time or uh, but uh, uh, forgive me, I'm going to have to uh, uh, take off. Uh, amazing work. I appreciate you and you know, can't wait to see you next time. God bless you, man. Thank you. Thank so we have you. to Thank bring uh, Carl and uh, yeah, uh, <laughs> uh, Vincent next time from the yes. other side. Yeah. Yes. Thanks have for coming on, Ash. Thank you. Yeah, absolutely, you. Ron. Thank you, brother. Thank you for sharing you, all of that. Appreciate you. Of course. Yes. We'll talk next time. <laughs> all right. Have Thank you, buddy. Day. But. Take care. What did you folks think of that? Oh, sorry. Great. It's a great. Uh... What do you folks think of that? He shared quite a bit. Can you guys hear me? I want to make sure you hear me. Hear me? Okay, good. Yeah, I thought that was yes. amazing. It was yes, Lynn. It was mind blowing, David. What were you after that, David? This is this is uh, Lynn. This is one of my um, uh, campaign platform. I'm campaigning currently to stand for elections and. One of my three platforms, one is providing uh, quality homes, uh, quality homes with electricity and water. And the second one is accessing quality education. And uh, just by listening to what Ash has shared here in uh, online uh, platform, providing an online platform with uh, degree and doctorate and master's uh, uh, qualification by just staying back at your home or your house need to, for you to travel to uh, UK or Australia or even to our capital city in Port Mosby to enroll in a university. That money that you spend for airline ticket and accommodation and whatever meals that you, you spend while attending school there, you can now save and use that for other things that will provide quality to your life. And you can have a quality education right at your home, inside your home. So uh, this is this is mind you know, blowing. You know, this is something that uh, in Papua New Guinea, because of our geographical uh, um, uh, locations, we face difficulty in traveling to school. Even our children walk for, for days or even hours to get to school. They have to wake up early in the morning, uh, five o'clock in the morning to just to get ready. And another one or two hours to get to school. And sometimes they stay on the road to wait for a uh, public motor transport to take them to school. And if the car truck doesn't come, they are late, they miss classes. So those are the things that are hindering education in our country. And with the platform that we are being uh, uh, provided with by on passive um, as is is uh, is gonna help a lot of children not only in Papua New Guinea but right across, right around the world in in the countries that uh, have this uh, difficulty so this is powerful thank you thank you um, Lynn for sharing that thank you for sharing that it seems like on passive's platform is a fit with your campaign with your campaign uh, topic so it's kind of cool how that worked out, huh? It's just meant to yes. be. Yes, exactly. Awesome, awesome. 
All right, so now uh, we're gonna go into the presentation by Collins Mana. Did you wanna say, did you wanna interpret anything or you wanna just interpret later, David? Okay, I'll How do you wanna work it? Yeah, I'll just, uh, I'll just speak in pigeon short. Um, sure, paraphrase and summarize, go ahead. Thank you, Yumilo Papua New Guinea. Um, this is a short video where Lina me play um, Tripla Dego Pinis, uh, CEO of Blo Yumi, and been appear long meeting where Lina Narpla host Blangem Ron to plus our host him. Now, Emmy share him this la technology uh, platform where on passive by providing um, you may call him Okademi, but inside long Okademi, he got plenty sections he stop long. Uh, Different, different uh, area of blood training. One plus big plus something. I mean, talk talk long. I'm awesome now. You mean all picking in the old mama? Spending money long. Uh, in any Emmy, I mean, past Nami got and by Golo University. Papa Mama says, struggle now, funny money. Long selling picking in the Golong, uh, Port Mosby or Lale or University of Technology or UPNG or even Sampla Golo overseas. Law school, law Australia or Narpla country. Also, we finding big plum money can long spend him, buy him ticket. Na even long, suppose only go sell sponsor or by buying big plum money straight. Long uh, kiss him this la sawe. But now on passive, and we bring him this la access long education and we come straight inside long house doable you. You know not need long go long Narpla hub. You can stop now, suppose Max blow you and we qualify him, you long go attend him this la school. You can enroll at this like university inside Long House Blue you yet. You can go online. Now you can uh, enroll. Now time already accepting you law school. And now you yet want them teacher blow you or one of them lecturer blow day in an hour. And you two can run him course blow this like school blow you. So this like me provide him one plug and road where and by cut him down plenty uh, expense now. Papa Mama by saving big plum money. Now this la money can go back and help him family long care up him now look out him sit down long all. So M1 plus road where uh, long platform blow me time me long campaign and me talk talk long call access long quality education. M1 plus way by on passive I mean up long help him you me man Mary inside long Papua New Guinea. So thank you long harem blue plus. Now me losing go back and long lean by me plus go inside long our plus program where engineer blow me plus Collins mana. Collins Mana, M, M Stop Long uh, Britain, Law UK, United Kingdom. Now, time long, all this lot time now, I'm early morning, hours five o'clock, up past five long morning, now I go on top of seven or six o'clock morning. But all this hour, I sacrifice him time long, long come long, Mipla, Papua New Guinea, now helping Mipla, long, uh, look, so long, one of them company, Mipla, close stop inside because M, M uh, school, long, M, M inside long technology, now computer, so M Sour, this lot. This la business. Now, I'm trying to help me plan la look so long. One of kind business me plan close stop inside long them. So, suppose you found that you can uh, stop in scene, you can harem, uh, you or some guest, you join me plan this afternoon, you can stop in scene, harem, call in smana, and by explaining one of something me plan long stop inside long. One of kind business me plan stop inside long them. Thank you. Over to you, Lynn. Thank you, David. So, the, the topics that Collins Mana is going to cover are. Uh, software development using the Agile Scrum framework, security, compliance, and laser technology in terms of our data center. So I, I messaged it to you, David, in Messenger, in case you want to look at that, David. So we're going to let go, uh, Collins take the floor now. Thank you, Collins. Thank you, Lynn. Uh, Tony, thank you, Gladys. Uh, welcome. Just want to greet New Pagini. We love you. And we are here again to um, just to bring to you the, the method of um, developing software from scratch. That's the topic Mr. Ash Bufara gave us last week to talk about it. Hi, David. Thank you for, for accepting some of us to come and speak to you on your platform. So yeah, Mr. Ashmufara gave us this topic and it is really a massive, massive topic. It's a topic, if you want to really talk about it, it will take months. 
but we've just tried to summarize it just for 30 minutes, just to give you a, just an oversight, a highlight of what is happening, because this is the topic that um, Mr. Ash have already said long time they are using in developing all the software, and that's why they are cutting down time. Sometimes we ask ourselves, people said, oh, it's taking too long. It's not taking too long because of the, the process flow. That's why they have been able to cut down time. You know, something that can take four years is just taking about like short, maybe six months, one year, and you have a full-blown product. And we are talking about dozens of dozens of products, which is not easy. So I will read the topic, what Ms. Ashbufara said, and then we will go through the process. Before we end, by the end of the, the, the process, you guys will understand fully how software is developed and why Ms. Ashbufara is doing what he's doing now with the, with the team in Hyderabad. So the topic goes as follows. He said, having minimum value products. You know, the first thing we did was developing a minimum value product that's acceptable in the market. And then, then spraying by Scrum, master, by Scrum managers. So the method they are following, we've always heard Mr. Ashmufari talking about sprint, 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 sprint. Nobody even know what is spraying. You know, because sometimes people wonder, well, what is he talking about? What is he really talking about? What is really sprint? So we will explain that by the end of it, you'll know what sprint is all about. And the, then he says something about then a bigger product release. So when you have a minimum value, then you have a bigger product release, and then you have multiple releases, then preparing the products for marketplace. You know, that's where the marketing is coming. We have Tony Tango, we have Tony here to even talk something about marketing. And you, then you're preparing the product for, 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 to go viral. So when you prepare the product for marketplace, it means you're preparing the product to go live. You know, in the production environment, Mr. Ash talked about production environment and um, um, you have a um, development environment and you have production or live environment. That's when all the users can see this product. What we've been seeing for more than three years, this is the time they will see it for their first time. The world will see it. That's when you prepare the product now for, for the acceptance, you know, in the whole wide world. So let's look at it. I will share my screen because there's something that is good to see it visually. So let me share my screen and we look at the process. So, so if you can see my screen, can you see my screen, Lynn? Is that great? Yes, yes we can. Very clear. Yeah. So, you know, Mr. Ashbufara really brought this topic because he want most of the founders and those who are doing to really see what is happening. So, the process goes is agile Scrum framework. So we want to look at it because you cannot talk about Spring if we just dive deep into Spring. A lot of people will not understand what is Spring. So we said no. Let's look at the agile Scrum because Spring is a subset in Scrum, and where is Scrum coming from? It's coming from agile. So agile methodology have a lot of framework within because it's a very very broad way of doing business or a platform where you can easily develop software, or maybe you can use it to run any business of any type. Financial service can use it. But what in Agile do you really want to use? The framework you want to use? Is it Scrum, which is the most popular? Is it Lean? You have someone they call Linear. You have Extreme Programming. You have Crystal. You have Kanban. There's just a lot, lot within the Agile framework. But most companies like to use Scrum, you know, because normally, it helps in, you know, navigate and deliver a possible, a, the, the software of a highest value. It's not like the rest are not important. They are very important. But most companies, for some reason, they love the Scrum because Scrum is like a cross-functional team and there's a lot of collaboration between the teams. You know, so that collaboration way of working in the Scrum framework, that is what makes Scrum the most popular framework in software development. So let's look at it. What is Scrum? Says Scrum is a framework within which people can address complex adaptive problem while productively and creatively delivering product of the highest possible value. So people can collaborate, work together as a team to ensure that they deliver product of the highest possible value. So let's look at it, how it works. Let's go to the next slide. Now, the next slide is Scrum. I will explain sprint, but I just want us to look at this diagram, just visualize. So the first box you have, so normally in any co every company, 
they have a project management software, but we, we just, you know, I just like try to extract this. Some people will use Jira, you know, that's where they run their project. Some will use Trello. So you can Google it, you'll see it's a project management um, software. Some will use, um, um, there's a lot, lot out there. So most companies use Jira because it's more easy to use. So say we look at this, Mr. Ash Bufara Khan said, okay, I've put the set of engineer, you know, hundreds of them, but within the Scrum, normally when to build like a particular, to work on a particular function, you don't need too many people. So minimum is about four and maximum should be eight, not nine, nine is too crowded. So to build just a function, I'm not talking about the whole software like OMIL, to build like, say, the, we have our calendar, you just need a couple of them to build it because there they can really concentrate. So now we look at uh, the, 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 the whole of this diagram. Mr. Ash Mufara has all the idea in his head. He said, okay, I want to be OMIL, or maybe let's say our go founder and O founder. Any of this product we have in our, in our arsenal said, okay, I want to build it. Mr. Ash Mufara has all of this thing in his brain. So put those guys together in Hyderabad. Said, this is what I want to do. I want this, 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 and this in all mail. And I want it to be developed within this time. Now you have somebody, because normally within the Scrum framework, you have, you have the event, which is the, 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 the meetings. You have um, the people, which is the development team, the, the, the Scrum master, and the product owner. Those are, that's it. You don't have too many group of, of, of teams, you know, development teams, they are you know, of different expertise. And then you have Scrum Master and you have pro, uh, uh, Product Owner. Product Owner act as a project manager. So these guys, there can be many of them depending on the project, but one works on a particular project. Say to Mr. Ash, okay, tell me, what do you really want? What is the order of priority? Yes, you said you want A, B, C, D, E, F. Tell me which one do you really want first? Because we cannot build all of them in Big Bang. Tell us, I said, okay, I want this first, I want this second, I want this third, I want this fourth. Now, the, the project manager will take that information that Mr. Ashbu Farah, uh, Mr. Ashbu has provided, and write it in the form of a user story. In Scrum, they call it user story. What is user story? It's a form of writing, like, for instance, you can say, as a user, say you want to build an admin screen. The way they will write it, they have their format. As a user, I want an admin screen that I can manage all the employee. I can see whatever they are doing and I can give them certain permission level for them to carry out their function you know, successfully. That is a user story. It is massive, it is vague. Now, this guy will take it and say, yes, all right, I know what you want. Sit now in the meeting. So everything Ms. Alpha have said, they will put it in the product backlog. They call it product backlog. All what they will do to develop our own mail or go founder, whatever product, just Think about our product, everything in our ecosystem, they'll put it in there. Now he will take one of these functions, he said, okay, I want the admin, admin screen. That is the, 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 the thing I want first. Mr. Ash Mufara will come, these guys will take it, the product owner will come and sit in a planning meeting, they call it spring planning meeting. I will explain what it means and I'll explain spring. So in the meeting, he said, okay, I need 10 developers, five developers, come and sit with me. This is what Mr. Ash Mufara have said we should build. Now let's ready to go. The planning meeting is a whole day meeting. You know, sprint is a time box. When they talk about sprint, it's a time box. Everything is time. There is no time to waste. There is no gap to waste. So in that meeting, that meeting takes nine, eight or seven hours, maximum the whole day. Group of engineers sitting there, look at that, that function. I said, okay, as a user, I need this. So what are the, val the values or the screens, you know, they will break it down into smaller component. Okay, in admin screen, we need a login screen. We need this, we need that, we A, B, C. They break it down into some other component called um, um, acceptance criteria. You have the user story, you break it down to acceptance criteria, a criteria that I can tick and say, yes, you, the, this screen has this, yes. The screen must have this, yes, the screen must have this. All tick, 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 tick. It takes almost nine, minimum seven hours just to break down that particular topic. Now, they will put it, when you break it down, they break it down, they say, yeah, happy days. Put it in another column called the sprint backlog. The sprint backlog is what they will do for that particular sprint. It's like you manage your job, 
He said, okay, today, this is what I want to do. Though I have all of these things I will do for the rest of the month, but what do I want to do for this week? That particular work for that week, you organize it and you put it like your calendar. This is what I'll be doing. All of us have calendar, what we'll do for the day. Put it all for the week in that box they call Spring Backlog. Now, the person called Mr. Scrum Master who come and said, okay, I want to be the gap between the product owner because I don't want them to distract the team because sometimes if they don't have someone really keeping them in control, there'll be too much distraction. So the Scrum Master ensure that there is no distraction between the team that are developing the software and the product owner. Because the product owner talked with Mr. Ash Mofara and the management board, but this Chrome master said, no, stick there. That's your job. They don't come close to this team. This team, I want to make sure they deliver the product, what we have agreed in that spring planning meeting. So there is no distraction. So you just you know, keep them intact and just remove all those noise and said, we want to get this done. So even if Mr. Ashmore come and said, I want something, they'll say, no, we are committed in this and we'll deliver this. Come next time, Mr. Ashmore, Father, thank you very much. We know you want that, but we're not doing that for now. That is how they do it. That's how in Scrum, if you are not really strong, you can really miss the target and miss the goal. So you keep the team focused on the goal at hand and the work at hand. So for instance, do, something can be very, very important. Maybe Mr. Ash will go through the pro, to product owner and product owner can call Scrum. Hey, Mr. Scrum Master, come. This thing we miss, what can we do? Then they have to come here into this spring backlog, take one thing out, adjust that and put it in here. But it takes time to do that. You know, it must be a lot of debate and argument. Why? Because people are committed to do what they want to do because it can change the dynamics of what they are doing. So they'll keep them and do. So when they, they come in, development start. Every day they have a daily meeting. So they, they can they will run it for one week, but they have a daily meeting. They call it a, a daily stand-up. And that meeting lasts only for 15 minutes. 15 minute meetings. You said every team, it's not like someone, or there is no manager, there's no director, there's no title in Scrum, no title. You can, you can, we know okay, they, they have their different expertise, but there is no title. So when they come, it's a free speech. I can say, oh, who goes first? Tony said, I will go first. Okay, Tony, you tell us what you do yesterday. Tony said, I did this, this, and ABC. He said, okay, what are you doing today? Tony said, I'll do this. Two minutes, only two minutes, no more, not more than two minutes because we have just short time, 15 minutes for, for the team to just say what they are doing. It's just about inspection and transparency. Now they said, Tony, do you need any help? Tony said, no, 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 I don't need any help. I'm fine. Collins, I'll take over. The next person, the next person, we just say it and we are all, we all, because it's a cross-functional collaborative team. Then that daily meeting done every day within a week to deliver this software. There's daily standup, 15 minute meeting in the morning or afternoon just to just to, to have that transparency and adaptation and stuff like that. Until that one week sprint is done, then whatever they accept they'll, they'll, they'll do, they've completed all the work in the backlog. They'll move it into this box called increment. So from this box, Mr. Ashbufra will come in and say, we always hear Mr. Ashbufra said, I have a demo. They will demo something to me. They have to show me. They call it sprint review meeting. That meeting will last for about one hour, 30 minutes, or not more than one hour, 30 minutes, 90, 90 minutes. Done. This actually will go, go through all the checks, go through all the checks and say, happy days. Job done. Guys, move on to the next sprint. They will come back to this box. But before they come back to this box again, they have to do retrospective. This other meeting again, retrospective meeting, again, it's 90, 90 minutes not more. That meeting is about reflecting on the job they have done. You know, the difficulties they have, the challenges, what challenge they encounter and how can they mitigate that challenge. So when they move into the next sprint, they will not have that again. What they can keep. So we've done something. No, we don't want to do that again because we know it brought us a lot of problems. Let's change this. Let's do this. Let's do this. It's about inspection, transparency, and adaptation, all of that. So they go and they look at it because it's a team. And the beauty about the Agile Scrum is because the customer is involved. So Mr. Ash Mufara act as a customer. So he can come in and look at it and say, no, change it, do this. Because you just change it within, within a, a second or minute and the work is just going. Now let's look at definition of, of, of sprint. What is definition? It says sprint is a set of period of time during which a specific work has to be completed and made ready for review. 
So they, we are talking about review meeting. So within that sprint, it's a time box. So you two hours, if you look at all the meetings I've shown you, seven hours or nine hours, three hours, you know, 90 minutes and all of those type of things. So it's just about timing and timing and timing because within Agile Scrum, time matters. There is nothing, there is, there is limited documentation. For instance, if Tony is doing something, or I'm doing something, say Tony is working a team with me. If Tony says, I ask Tony, 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 I, I, there is nothing I can, so there are times I, I can send like long lists of email. Tony said, no, Collins, I don't really want to read. Just come here, show me what you want me to do. I said, okay, I want red. Tony put red, he said, are you happy? Yes, done. Little documentation. People don't have time to read documents. Tell me what you want me to do. That's why they call it cross-functional team where they, everything is written in the form of user story, two sentences, two lines, and they can develop. And that is it. So that's, that's the, the meeting. And within that framework, they are building the software. You know, they build like the minimum value software it's coming out nicely and they are integrating it. You know, they are compound, as I said, compounding, compounding until it becomes a full blown product. And then what will happen? The product now is ready for the market and then they'll be having multiple releases. Because again, if you build OMIR, or Academy, or all of those things, and you stop there, what will happen? Your competitors will come, build all your functional function you have, add new things that you don't have. That's why we are saying on passive is ahead of the game because they already know what will happen in 20, maybe 2030 or 2040, but they will not give everything to the market because what will you build again if you get everything? That's why Mr. Alfred said, we will continue to build, we will continue to compound. We have the products now that we say we, we are happy to go to the market, but don't worry, there are still more things to come. So if we release all mail this year, given next year, that all mail, you will not even recognize it because new features will be added. That is what all the other companies are doing. And they go through some of them, the major company go through Scrum. And sometimes you hear, whoa, they've had done releases. For instance, just to call the name, you say iPhone. Remember when iPhone came, it was shabby. Can you compare iPhone now and the iPhone, the first iPhone? It's two different things because they go through that process. They are just doing compounding and comp And this is what we are good at, built by artificial intelligence and that compounding effect, adding new function upon new function, be it Academy, or mail or Trim, or Tracker. They will have that multiple releases coming year after year, month after month. So let's look at Sprint. You look at the sprint, that's how it's the cycle. One cycle, what they are doing in Hyderabad is two weeks sprint. So this cycle can go on for two weeks. You plan, you design, you develop, you test. Deployed means you take it to the environment where it is ready for review. Mr. Asmofara look at it, review it, and then Mr. Asmofara push it to our old founder site for better testing. And when we are happy, we are ready to go live. You know, everything there, like what we have in our back office, Minimum value products and what Ms. Alfred said, said what the old mail and the product we are seeing, what they have added is much better, 10 times better than what it is a full blown product. I think it's just because it's now Ms. Mufa is too busy where they don't have time to give us to try. But he said he will show us and we'll see the product. He said the old mail is better than what we think. There is nothing that we'll ever choose. What we are seeing in the back office is just nothing more than what they have now. That is a compounding effect, more functionality. Now let's look at the value. So we said this takes one, two weeks, move on, develop, and then go. Develop and go, develop and go. That is the sprint. That is how the cycle goes in a, in a cross-functional team. Now let's look, look at the value. What are the sprint value? For you to be able to work in this type of environment, you must be courageous. If you are not courageous, there is no way. No, understand that you will take complex products or complex information and you have to break it down to simpler information that is understandable and that is can be developed to a full-blown product if you're not able to do that forget it this is not for you that's how it is in it in most of this environment you must be focused in everything you do you know because you need to concentrate on the goal like we said i i think i, I last time i talked about scrum scrum came it comes from the from rugby you know, but a lot of people don't know that you are working in a chaotic, a nice chaotic environment with an eye to the goal. You know what you want to achieve. It's the same with, 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 with um, the, the Scrum process in, 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 in software development. 
It's a little bit chaotic because you talk to this, talk to that, but everybody is so concent uh, concentrated or focused on what they want to deliver because you have time to deliver that. It's a time box process. And then you must be committed. You must be committed to achieve, not you are, you, you'll be fired. And you must respect. Respect is the order of the day. You don't treat your colleague badly. You know, you make everybody around you comfortable because you guys are working as a team. It's a cross-functional team. It is a self-organized team. Nobody comes and organizes it for you. You put yourself together and develop. That is how it is. There is no manager. There is no title. There is nothing. It's a self-organized, cross-functional and, and collaborative team. And then there must be openness. If you can't do it, say, I can't do it. Or if you don't, if not, on, just say, no, I don't get it. Please, can you explain again? Don't say yes. And after one week, they come, you've not done anything, you'll be fired. And that, that is, that is the, the part of the Agile Scrum. And that is how they develop the software. Now, let's look at security part. In every development cycle, there is security embedded in it. You must test, you know, test the database, make sure everything is encrypted, make sure every functions and things that are coming are all secured because you can't build a software that is not secured. People will hack it. You know, the database, they do penetration testing, they make sure the, the, the software is, 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 is less vulnerable to attack. You know, there's a lot of volume testing, you know, to make sure when the, you have the amount, we are talking about billions of customers that will be coming on unpassive. Are you sure the software will not crash at a certain point? That is vulnerability as well. You know, you must, be, the speed as well is something that you take because these are all performance type of testing and secure testing. So you ensure that nobody can go in and break anything. That is security and nobody can hack into the system. It must be compliance. There must be compliance because remember, a lot of people don't know that you don't build a piece of code and throw it out there. It must be compliance and there's regulation all over the world. For instance, if you want to build a health software, you must understand what, for instance, in or Canada or USA, UK or any other country, you must follow their rules and regulation. What is acceptable and what is not acceptable. You know, you must be, if not, they will shut that company down. So it's every software, be it whatever we build, you must make sure it meets the regulation and complies with everything we are doing as human. You can build a software and allow it for something to happen. Then they'll come and bite you. That is the compliance part of it. Now let's look at laser technology. We're talking about our data center. Right, Mr. Anufra said we already heard that the, 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 the data center will have a laser technology. What is laser technology? And it's just a part of system that is hooked on top of our data center that boosts, you know, as Mr. Anufra said, ping, you know, the direction, you know, and look at every location where our data can reach. For instance, the fiber optic cable is there. It carries, transmit all this data, but what happened with laser? The laser boosts the, 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 the data flow. It gives more, uh, um, 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 it makes the, 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 the data center to be more efficient and, flex, and flexible. So for instance, when you make search, you can easily see it. So it identifies the environment before the data is even transmit through and from the database. You know, that is what, that, that's the beauty about laser technology. The fastness, but secondly, it is cheaper. You know, it is cheaper, but it is really efficient and effective when it comes to data center. I think that's the only thing. I don't need to really go into the technology behind laser technology, but the only thing we should take from here is it is cheaper, it is faster, and it is efficient, but it doesn't take the place of the fiber optic cable because it helps to boost the fiber optic for, for better transmission, can penetrate an area where there are low connectivity and stuff. So... I would leave it there and lean. Take it, take it from me. Thank you very much. Thank you, Collins. We do realize that was a great presentation. We do realize that this is a tremendous amount of information to be presented. Uh, Collins and I are fully aware of that. So David, how do you want to work this? Um, Co Collins just went over the Agile Scrum framework, but he's also going to be talking about compliance, security, and internet um, laser technology. So do, should he pause right now and allow you to at least summarize and paraphrase uh, 
or did you want to do the interpretation in another forum? I'll let you make that professional decision, David. Thank you, Lynn. Thank you, Lynn, and thank you, Collins, for that uh, uh, powerful information. You know, a lot of the things are technical. I understand that uh, most of our people wouldn't really grasp it, but I will want to uh, summarize it in Pigeon just to give an analogy of what's uh, happening. Um, we know that a lot of our people, founders have been asking, when is the company launching? You know, it's taking too long for the company to launch and they don't know what's, what sort of work is going on behind the scenes. And thank you Collins for this, because this really gives us an understanding on what is really happening behind the scenes. And it is taken this time for, for the company to come this far. So I will just translate in Pigeon and just to give a breakdown on what, uh, uh, summarize what Collins has uh, said. Uh, I wouldn't uh, explain the technical part of it, but I will just uh, uh, put it in a analogy where we will understand. Um, thank you all line blue email of Papua New Guinea. And thank you long Colin Mana. I'm sorry man long this la work long technology. I'm coming inside I'm on plan engineer. So I'm explaining him. Uh, one of something work long come up. Inside long on passive, you miss out some planting, found up, you me only stop, only join two years, three years. Uh, some probably join six months as well. Now I'll ask him one in time by company loans. One in time by company loans. I am me like talk so you blow them. This black company on passive, I'm no one plus legally company. I'm no one plus legally company not sold by you build him, now by you start long selling product. This black M1 plus technology company. Now technology company, I say I got plenty, plenty work. Uh, is a come up backside long this law one in product called you long come up him long m. So you know me, me to play no clear too much of plenty product. Now one plus product and you me o'clo use him. Long one plus company I'll call him Zoom and me to play o'clo sit down na you me look long. This la video conferencing na stop. This play one plus can product where m one plus as well na this la company Zoom and me send up backside and walk in business long m. This la one plus product. All right. You and me, me plus look, me plus tap in on passive, on passive. You may have some plenty only talk of them. You may got more than fifty plus products, huh? So, lo build him this like kind of company, na this like kind of product, and all big plus big plus product inside long tech uh, technology. So, you and me, you say now me to plus looking calling see talk talk. You know, legally work and say go inside long this like. Long cut him down time this like kind of, uh, work and by taking close to some one plus five years, ten years long. Uh, company by ready one plus product or same number launch him go to marketplace like customer by use him now you may inside on passive you may got more than 50 plus products now you know legal product or send me like kissing you or thinking though you come that looks how long one in size but this like company and big black company too much so emmy take him plus close to three years three and a half years now long boss man blow you me as move for one time all engineers Lo sawe long em em toko sem because em by take him long plat time long. I build him this la company na really simple product or market. Em bring him close to or sem eight hundred man Mary. Only now stop lo inside long Hyderabad lo India. Em operational based lo yumi lo India. Na all say walk twenty four hours long. Walk him this la company na walk him all slow product. So you can look him one plat kind explanation em call him see make him product all by making him, all by kiss him, come back and all by test him again and walk good or you know walk good or go again straight him again come back and so he got one one team or one one product so you know legally all uh, uh line man mary or local work or something so me like talk so him. suppose you join him uh, on passive you may wait legally time to son a lot of engineer walking walk long all and walk from me to play and most of all talking me to play penis you know me me to play no need long sour long in company how does the company work low work because m work long company in all workman long m me to plus and founder and me to play pain registration fee by me to plan a middle come up as a partner one time as move for a ceo blame me lots of dream and long m long help him now kill up him sit down long old man mary inside on this la ground so am I creating this company or am making this company come up? Or you know me by me to plan in up or partner one time. Now one of them can something benefit and become am sharing one time me to plan. 
you mean up lo straight in life lo mitupla dia na o mitupla ken tanim na luluk na straight in all help family na all napla line in chalo community blo yumi so em big plus thing thing me like kissim you come na thing him this la one em walk walk long go in chat lo nisla company all workman walk lo walk in all league walk em big lo walk to us so me explain him osem this la ino say take him short lap time long come up in this la kind technology company but you na me mitupla lucky because as mufara emi kisi modern man mary all engineers all survey line all, all number one survey line in chelo like work law technology na bungi mol one time na lok lok work long you na me by me to plan enjoy benefit plus la company so thank you lawyer haram na me give him go back and lin thank you lin you can take it on again from here all right david would you like us to to address the additional topics of compliance security and internet uh, the laser technology or would you rather we pause right now and open it up for questions and answers i i think we can leave the other leave the other topics we can open it up for people to ask questions um because i see that it's uh, quite a uh, a technical topic and to grasp everything at the same time would be a bit uh, loaded for all of us so uh what Colin yeah. just shared here is already more than enough for us to chew so yes. we will uh I, i'd like us to open up the um, forum so that we can all ask questions about it thank you okay i agree with that fully even for um others it's a it's a big topic wide breadth and scope you know what i'm saying so why don't you go ahead and invite our png people to make comments and questions now we'll go ahead david thank you thank you uh you me all png line you sit down low on a map corner lord display hub uh country blue you me and me plot to stop low place me got all big plug group all stop back side low me all look watch him some club uh plenty all founder some play more guest yet all look 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 stop so please png come now ask him question you can uh, up him on blow you, put him honey go on top of him, little, little button stop down blow long uh, uh, screen blow you by look at him and go up. You can uh, click him this la on, uh, you can ask him question. Uh, plant is something, call him to Emmy cover him. That's all, you can stick long topic long uh, now. Uh, want him something or difficulty or hard, you, uh, something where you find him where me hard, little, little you, you can ask him question now. Thank you very Thank much, you. David. And as a reminder to our international community who are here with our PNG people, we are going to give priority to our PNG folks to ask their questions and make comments because this is their time. This is their webinar already. So let's let's honor that. We I see Arnold Lakamanga has his hand raised. Let me unmute you. Go ahead and unmute. You're unmuted now, Arnold. Go ahead and speak. Okay, thank you. Thank you, Lynn. Um, thank you. Colin, you have given us priceless uh, education this afternoon. No, we pay too much to actually go to an institution to learn what you have given us for free. Uh, much appreciate, Colin, for what you have given us. And of course, uh, I've been going in and listening to the text pro uh, sometimes and Again, we get valuable uh, education from your presentation. Um, the presentations there, Aline, uh, you're an angel to PNG. You know, you constantly facilitate um, this platform, bringing people like Colin and others to educate us more, uh, more on passive and more on the products, and more uh, on what the impacts on passive will have on on us as individuals and, and of course, on the country. Um, S has given us some thoughts and I thought, firstly, let me share that before I go to my two questions. I have two questions. Um, he, he did mention something about, you know, when you go to universities, you take up courses which are termed as electives. Uh, these are courses more, not necessarily in tune with your bachelor's degree course or your master's course. Now, it, it is something out of what you are actually learning, something out of 
uh, out of the topic. And um, you know, from my from my exper experiences, I've also taken electives, and they are basically useless courses. Uh, they are courses which we take to make up the points to graduate at the end of the year, or at the, at the end of our courses. And um, one passive is taking away this. Um, Minnesota, if you are or Papua New Guinea, understand him, time as he come inside, and I'm talk talk plus some of course with Middle Sacks University. I mean, no relevant to much long bachelor's degree, blah, 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 or master's degree, blah, blah. Middle Sacks kiss him because people are by kissing credit points. Because time you finish in university, you must get a certain number of credit points when you graduate. So plenty of time, maybe let's go inside, maybe let's like see more courses where in a relevant long course from people or degree from people. Maybe like you see, maybe meet him points, and then by the time maybe like finish some course from people, maybe like meet him more enough points, maybe like graduate. But don't perceive, you know, it's taking away that elective business. We want to learn something about Let's say IT, we strictly go in and for non passive, it's giving us opportunity to learn about IT and we gain knowledge about IT. Now, some like, and some of like courses and uh, academy by providing Lomipla and university only recognize him by only can give him degree Lomipla. They like take him on black pencil, black masters, and black PhD as well courses. So that's something that maybe I just wanted to also uh, speak in pigeon. So our uh, or people understand what elective courses are at the universities. Um, my my two questions. Uh, one is one is on a uh, smart link. So sometime back, I think um, as mentioned something about smart link and Colin, maybe you have mentioned also something in one of your tech uh, presentations. Uh, I'm just wondering whether smart link is something that we founders can have access to from our from our front office, or is it something that is happening at the back office that we really do not need to worry too much about? And that is the first question on smart link. Okay, the second one. Let's let uh, um, Colin answer that first, please, if you don't mind. Yes. Colin, go ahead. We'll take it in chunks, you know. Yes, Colin. Right. Yes. Uh, I, I know Ash mentioned, mentioned something about smart link, and normally for now, we know I need to, we still need to check that because it's something to do with a lot of things, I think transmission or something. I know Ash mentioned a lot of things that will be coming, but we've not looked into that until there's like more details coming out. I know they mentioned it and we've not really taken a look because that was the first time. But again, it's more of technology which okay. time will come with the answer again. Okay, thanks, Colin. Uh, the second one relates to the language translation. Um, I would very much like to have Pigeon included in the translation. Now, what does it take uh, to have our language like Pigeon, you know, incorporated into this um, real-time language translation of, of uh, I think it's just more of coding. So, for instance, if you know when they were doing the translation of the ebook, when they asked of all the, the language translation, assuming they put it there, they would have done it in the back, you know, from the back end. So, it's just about coding. So, the, the, the guys in Hyderabad will look at it and then write the code. But it's just to mention it to Mr. Ash and said, okay, I think they'll like um, Pigeon be added in the translation and then they will sit back and then maybe go through. I remember most often they were asking about those who want um, unpassive to be translated in their language, they can do it. But again, if you're talking about the unpassive, the old founder side, and if you're talking about real-time translation, it's still about coding, right? For instance, O-Academy and, um, and O-Connect, there is real-time translation, Ms. Advar talk about that. But it's something to do with coding and they can map it. So I think it's something that they can do. Nothing is important in IT. That means it has to be done by someone who is quite fluent in, in pigeon and also coding. Yeah, no, you don't need to, you don't need to give the translation and they can write the code. 
There are I'm not in Spanish, but I've worked on Spanish application. You just need to give the information and they'll, they'll write it and put it there. Uh, for instance, just, if, if, for instance, uh, if I have a if I have a pigeon dictionary, we can send it over and they can work it from there. Correct. Yes, you just give what you want and they'll check it. And you know, most most of the things are all in in Google. So sometimes they look at it and said, okay, if pigeon is already there, they can Google it and look at it and said, okay, this means this in English because remember, in code everything is written in English, but it is dynamic. So the moment you give the language. They push a button, it will just translate it to that language. Um, Colin, sorry, David, go ahead. Just, uh, and Arnold, just for yes. your information, <clears throat> our the ebook was translated by Susan, my late wife, into Pigeon, and it's uh, with Jeffrey Moloch. Jeffrey has forwarded it to the engineers in Hyderabad mm -hmm. to include it in the in the back office. <clears throat> Thank you. So that should contribute to the engineers, uh, uh, as Collins has said, to code it into a, uh, to translate it into English. David, you answered it. Um, that's it for me, Lynn. Thank you. Thank you, Arnold. Thanks for a good question. Are there any more comments or questions from our PNG folks? Don't be shy. David, can you uh, elicit some questions and comments from them? Go ahead and speak, Pigeon. Okay, online, blow you mean? Thank you, Anol Long, uh, ask him also a good little question. So suppose you stop, you want to play, you sit down inside, now you're long harem stop. You like ask him one question. You know clearly on plus something, no can same. Put him on go on top. Now ask him a question. No can think of same one plus. Karangi question or you talk on them stupid question. No, got one plus question them stupid. Or got a question them good plus as well. So you can ask him now by clearing thinking some plus two all by same law. Ask him now. Stop now. Time you ask him now. And now all by same and sublong all. Thank you. I think we have a uh, Sajib. Sajib. Yes. Go ahead, hand Sajib. Up. Sajib, you just go ahead and unmute yourself and take the floor, Sajib. Very good. You are unmuted. You can go ahead and speak now. Good to see your video. The internet is really weak where you are. The connection is poor. So I think for us to understand you, you'll have to turn your video off and go ahead yes. and try again. Okay, thank you. I have a one question uh, for uh, calling. Mana, uh, actually, or is the laser system of on passive? Did you uh, just uh, tell me, or is the, the laser system of on passive? Did you got my point, brother Colin? Yes. Yes, yes. I think he's asking about laser technology, Colin. Yeah. So, yes, yeah, so what we are we just sharing here is something that we shouldn't really worry because on passive is doing everything for us. It's just about sharing the knowledge. But as you said, it's something to do with our data center. It's a modern technology. We sit on top of our data center and help for better transmission. We have the fiber optic cables. The fiber optic cables carry all the data from one end to the other. But what the laser uh, does, it's just like pinpoint the area. So it's like a faster way of pointing. For instance, I want to send information to say Tony or Lynn. The, 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 the laser will, 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 will first identify that area where the, the, the information is going and then trigger it so the fiber optic cable can say, okay, this is where it's going. Let me just push it there. So it's just about making it more robust and more, you know, a lot of making more dynamics. And it, it's just lot, lot. But as you said, it's more cheaper, it's better, but it is more efficient and effective. That means uh, this is the totally uh, new uh, innovation. Or our, it's, new. Our it's, it's new. It's, it's there, but it's new. But remember, what we are doing is more of AI. Yes. Hey, hey. Really, just fire for on passive. Hey, hey. Thank you, Colin. And thank nice. you, Lynn. Thank you, Sajib. 
Thanks for your question. Again, we're giving priority to PNG. So if any PNG hands go up, we'll call them first. But at this time, I don't see any. So we're going to go on to Akram Hussein from Bangladesh. You can take the, the floor. Oops, wait, hold on. One second, Akram. I see Karen George raised her hand. Karen, go ahead and unmute yourself. She is from PNG. She'll go first. Thanks, Akram. Thanks, Lynn. Thank you, everyone. Thanks to all our international participants who are with us today. Um, I have two questions to ask on Academy. The first question is um, on the Academy training platform. How do we go about getting in, into the, the training field? Do the participants or the founders buy the entire product to use it? Or do we use the, the domain to have access to the training field? That's my first question. Colin, do you want to take that? Yeah, I can answer it. Yeah, so as a founder, it's free for you. That's the beauty about Unpassive. So remember, if we listen to what Mr. Ash Bufara said, a lot of teachers' university will put their courses on academy. And whichever course you want to take, or maybe you want to a certification or a degree course program in nursing, in fishing, maybe those who love to play guitars, anything, you know, will be in on passive in academy. The only thing you need to do is to click a button, select the course you want, watch it, and then go through the modules from one to the other. Maybe you have all the trainings going on. You can just follow it, follow it. By the end of your training, you are qualified. Medicine or whatever, Mr. Ajifara said, we will have everything. The best of the best teacher will come and put their, their courses there. And the beauty about it, you'll, be, you'll, you'll, be, you'll have a qualified certificate, not like the other one where you have certificate of attendance, which is just worthless. So that's the beauty about on passive. So don't worry as a founder, it's, it's in for you. Like the way you see all the products in your back office, that's how it will be. And you go and then you can use it. And as a teacher, you can also put it, that's extra stream of income. I think Tony will even talk about that. You can put whatever you think, like for instance, those who are expert here, medical doctors, we have them here, they can, you know, put whatever they want to put. But again, on passive will screen it and make sure what you want to deliver is fit. So it must be of the highest standard. Thank you. Uh, we have Gladys Naburo and Tony Monk who are our co-hosts as well. I want to feel free to chime in if they'd like to. Karen, did that answer your question? Yes, that's on the old founders. How about the resellers? People who are not um, founders, do they still use the same uh, channel that we use? Yeah, resellers will be, yeah. Because remember they are paying monthly for the products. So they will be able to have, depend on the package they will come because we don't know normally what will happen, but the package that Mr. Ashford, if Academy is there, then they can use it. We don't know how they will arrange the, the various package for resellers. But we know as founders, everything, everything will have it. Everything our ecosystem okay. will have. But for resellers, we don't know until the details come out, then we can say, yeah. But again, if they, 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 it's there in the package, they will use it for free. Only customers will pay because customers pay, you know, month in, month out to use our products. All right, let us pause Thanks, for Colin. a bit. So to allow David time to interpret, and then we'll go on to Tony Muck because I believe his hand is in response to the same topic. But let's give David time to go ahead and interpret or paraphrase. Go ahead, David. Thank you, um, Lynn. Just to add on to what um, uh, Collins has explained in regard to Karen's question regarding the signing on, uh, seeing Last, last week we talked about the single sign-on. So it's just, it's just uh, uh, an example of you're going into, a, you only have to go in one main door and when you open it up, instead of going to each door separately and opening each door 
uh, but by themselves, you just go in one, and then when you open the door, you see all the products at your and uh, just for our viewers. Okay, long long on passive. This la last time we have been talk talk lost single sign on all engineers. It's sixteen hours. I've been explaining last uh, uh, topic single sign on single sign on MSM. You come inside long one plus house. Now you look him, you got plenty of room stuff. Plenty of room stuff. You go to this room, but you look him this kind of service. You go to this room, but you see him this service. That's all inside long on passive. You are some founder. And you got one plus sign on that's all. Now you may have sign on, now go inside or back office, but you may have the same sign on that's all, but you go inside. Now you access him all the products, low one plus half. So kind of same now, uh, Karen, let me ask him. So you may go inside, low, you may go along this la academy or this la online platform, low, low school. Mm -hmm. And time you sign on once, and you access him penis, or some founder. Or some founder, this la am access low you. Or some customer, and by different, all got different. Different package by lineup long depends long uh, one kind package only buy or some and talk law reseller reseller too and by that monthly fee and yet by buy you know some you me found out where company system by rouse him automatically na pay him na or some that lot this last side long you go inside long uh academy platform time you like uh studying one plus something and by you go inside now you got instructions or guide blue stuff and by helping you long go inside the platform, now one of them kind of course is stop inside now, yet you by select him. Now you by going inside, now you start lining this course. So thank you. Uh, thank you, Olga Dalo RM, and legal explanation of them. So by me giving go back and Lin. Thank you, Lin. You can uh, take it on from there again. Thank you very much. Tony, go ahead and add to the discussion. Thank you, Tony. Thank you very much, Lynn. It's uh, great uh, co-hosting this with you. Thank you for hosting this webinar. It's amazing. Uh, Collins, thank you again for being here and sacrificing yourself uh, to give us the technical part of what's going on. Um, yeah, uh, the um, Academy is just is going to be just as simple as logging into Zoom here. Uh, probably a lot simpler. Ash is making everything as simple as possible. Um, Gladys, also great to see you here as well. I there's a few, David, thank you very much for having us again on your uh, PNG webinar. Um, I wanna speak to the Papua New Guinea people. And uh, I just wanna let them know that I'm also a simple person as well. I don't understand a lot of the technical part of it. I've been in this uh, uh, marketing part of it for 26 years now. And uh, so I'm very good at the marketing part of it and understanding the concept of the marketing. But when it comes to the IT part of it, I don't understand it. Now, I just want to say that uh, uh, Collins, when he explains the, uh, the technical part of the products, it's only for educational purposes only. He's trying to explain to everyone in PNG uh, what we actually have. We have something absolutely phenomenal. It's never been done before. This is the first time in history. Ash is making it as simple as possible. We don't need any, nothing is complicated. This is an automated system. When we go into hard launch, it's going to be an automated system that's going to be working for you behind the scenes. And you don't need to know any of the technical part of it. And you don't need to know any of the marketing part of it either. You're not recruiting anyone. You're not really doing anything. The only thing that Ash, our CEO, is asking everyone to do is to be is to be engaged as much as possible and to try and ins get in. Because when you're engaged, you get inspired. We're all inspired, as you can see. I've been inspired right from 2018. I've been a founding member since 2018. None of this, what we have right now, what we're talking about, existed back then. We didn't have any of this. So I've seen it come from a, a, a fetus to what it is today. And it's absolutely phenomenal. And thank God we have people uh, like our tech pro brothers, like Collins and Bob and Vincent and uh, um, sorry, uh, Collins, I forgot uh, the other one now. <laughs> Help me out here. Oliver. Oliver. How can I forget Oliver? Of course, <laughs> Oliver, my brother. Yeah, thank God we have our tech pros and our brothers and sisters to come and explain to us what it takes uh, to put something like this together. And, and to explain the, uh, the fact that some people think it's taking so long, it's not taking long at all. We are way ahead of time. We are years ahead of time because we have, we have about 
we have a few products that are completed right now. Just two of our products can take 10 years before its completion. Okay, we've been doing this for two years only, only two years. We've been working on the products and Ash keeps hiring more people to make it uh, uh, to complete it as fast as we can possibly complete it. But we're going to the hard launch pretty soon and uh, it's going to be very exciting. And like I said, it's very simple. It's not complicated. All this stuff that uh, Collins and our tech pros are talking about uh, is just to give you an example of what's going on. But the simple part of the whole thing is that you don't need to know any of it. It's an automated system. All you need to do is become involved to become a founder, uh, get back to the person that brought you here. And uh, I can guarantee your life will never, ever, ever be the same again. Thank you so much, Lynn. Back to you. Thank you. Tony, great points. We're going to allow David time to interpret that. And then we're going to go on to Karen George, who has part two of her question. So go ahead, David. Thank you, Tony. Thank you, Tony, my brother. Yeah. Okay, uh, Papua New Guinea, um, one of something, Tony talked 20, Tony, Tony and we got 26 year experience Los Salimol marketing, marketing Los Salimol products online. Uh, but let me talk about this technical side, long am low IT. And yet, I'm not so, I'm, I'm, I'm simple man, I'm professional, I'm nurse, I'm nurse. That's why I'm saying, work in online marketing, I'm saying, this la a business law online. So experience, long time I'm sharing, I'm talking about them. This la one something all technical line or some Collins now explain him yeah. I'm long help him you me long clear. Don't look so way or some. This la kind something I'm say come up inside long IT company, inside long all IT company time only come up in business long all. So I'm work long help him you me long look so way or this la that's all. You know me mid la no need lo so way or this last two. Mitla no need la sawe los latu. Mitla by enjoy him to solve this la products ya. All engineer working pinis na only put him lo market. Now you know me. Mitla by engine enjoy him to solve use him this la product. Because big la work him all work him. Now I'm talking. I'm talk company. I'm ready him two la products. I'm ready lo go lo market now. Now this la two la products ya. Suppose not la company work him. I'm by taking all more than five or ten years lo work him this la two la product. That's how long you me. As Mufara, Emmy Sauer Lodisla, CEO Blow Me, M Sauer now. Emmy employing plenty man, Mary, or plenty old engineers, more than 800 long time, me talk to car. So all this stuff now come up in this la two plus product, I'm inside of short lap time to sell, I'm two plus years to sell, I look like creative product. Now you me got more than 50 years, long time me talk, more than 50. So you can look Sauer. So you know me, me to play, work blow me to play, me to play, relax, that's all, pain found a fee, blow me to play, some, uh, uh, or some founder, pay registration or some founder. Now, Mitla can sit down to sell. Now, Mitla enjoy benefit and by coming to Lord Sla business where time and me launch the long uh, world. So, thank you, Lord Sla. You can sit back now. You may have number two question long, Karen. Thank you, Karen. You can go ahead. <clears throat> thank you, Karen. Go ahead and uh, unmute yourself and you can ask your second question. Thank you, David. Thank you, Lynn. Okay, my second question is um, regarding Sprint. The Collins have made a mention regarding the training. Okay, in the training field, if, if we commence doing the training and something happens along the training, maybe our mobile phone goes off or laptop, you know, dies out or the network drops, Will the training get saved so we can come back again and continue doing the training or will it will the timing goes on until it expires and then we fail? So how 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 is that possible? Who wants to take that? Maybe Collins, maybe? Oh um. I think Gladys Han is up. Gladys Han is up. Okay. Yeah. Yes. Oh, I Gladys wants to reply. Oh, okay. Sorry, yeah. Gladys. Go ahead. Sorry. <laughs> That's okay. <laughs> I can respond to that. Uh, Karen, 
And yes, our CEO Ash Mufari said that the classes will be recorded and you can attend them at your own time, at your own leisure, at your own schedule. You can do the classes in the morning, you can do them in the day, you can do, do them at night. So there is that flexibility, you don't have to worry. You can do them when the internet comes back. Thank you. I just wanted to Thank add you. to that, Lynn, if I could. Also, uh -huh, just to add to what uh, Gladys just stated, which was beautifully uh, stated, um, OnPassive is going to have videos, okay, uh, video step-by-step -step videos that are, that are going to teach everything you need to know about the products or whatever it is that you want to use. Just thought I'd throw that in there. Thank you, Lynn. Back to you. Good additional information. Thank you. David, you want to go ahead and interpret? Karen wants um, something. Maybe I don't know if she understands. Or... Oh, oh, let's see. Karen, did that answer your question? Yes, yes. My question is fully answered. Thank you so much. Thank you for asking your question. We appreciate you. David, go ahead. Okay. Karen, you've been asking this question, law said, law training. I'm training or clone go on long online or semi me talk to clone this lab product academia. So time you come in, are you selecting one plus course now you or clone learning online stuff now? Computer blow you bugger up or phone blow you go bugger up or network go put down or some lab now you lose lose track now you come back in this lab training yeah. I'm all record him now all by put him online and stuff so you can use him or some. Uh, glad to see me talk talk and talk this like training and I'll record him and Tony and add him and I'm talk awesome this like training and we'll record him now he got video video uh, presentation one time so and by stop you can you can school long night or you can school or sun or you can school during low early morning one in time you feel him and good time to school and you can come switch on the soul now you can you can line him this like subject for you thank you Thank you, David. All right, next we have Akram who's been waiting patiently. Good to see you, Akram from Bangladesh. Thank you, thank you, Lynn. Uh, I, I would like to actually uh, talk uh, to contribution or to give the message also PNG and also Bangladesh, Mr. Shojib uh, about the laser technology in Bengali language also. So <clears throat> firstly, I would like to tell about the academy uh, you see, uh, in P PNG, uh, I, I love you too much and greetings from Bangladesh to you every time in Bangladesh uh, in your site. So I would like to tell that Academy is a great, great product for the developing country and the underdeveloping countries. You know that we have a visa problem for to go the developed countries. You have to uh, you have to take the visa and you have to take the your graduation or uh, if you want to take high a higher education from the developed countries so there have you have no possibility to get the chance of also visa but ash mufara sars already talked some of the popular universities and dean and also uh, some of the professors and also he had managing. So there had the big, big opportunity. There had two, three subjects. There had the big, big opportunity for the, at this moment, trending, trending subjects like uh, computer science, medical science, and also uh, master's degree and others. Uh, some uh, Maybe this type of uh, another very, very trending BBA, MBA product. So and the, at this time, you you can join. If you are not a founder, you can join from your home. There have no need to foundership, but you will you will take the uh, you will take this course very nominal course, and you can also in physically there have you can class the physical and also the recording recorded version. There will be two of the option there you can do directly conversation with the professors and also if you are if you want to uh, that time you are so busy but in the in the next time you can get the recorded version so another another way i will tell that uh, this is really really it will be game change, changer and also for the uh, like the png countries and also other many many countries there have very 
underdeveloped there have this is the big big opportunity for us and secondly i would like i would like to tell that about the laser technology because you know that uh, in in this webinar also some of the bengali founders also here is presented so this is the actually new uh, revolutionary product and also some of i don't know so i would like to uh, some bengali also message them you you know that amra jara bangla bhashabashi jara royechi laser technology ta emon ekti technology eta already hocche nasa o kintu eta bortomane ta use koreche kintu apnara janen je amra jani amader amra normal jani je fiber optic fiber optic eta kintu glass glass dara tar age kintu fiber optic ta chilo na shekhane kintu amra jokhon internet er goti dekheche aro kom jokhon fiber optic diye amra jokhon shuru korechi tokhon kintu internet er goti ta aro beshi stable hoyeche ebong aro kintu hocchilo biddhi peyeche ar laser technology er madhye amra nischoy e recently amader je data center hocche she data center o kintu laser technology kintu shekhane use kora hobe ebong ei technology er madhye jekhane amader data gulo hocchilo onek druto jabe ami ekta example dite jai समय लगे हम प्राय तीन मिनट पांच मिनट एर लगे दुई मिनट लागे कारो एक टाइम जो एरिया डिपेंड कर टेक्नोलॉजी से एरिया बेदे टेन टू हंड्रेड टाइम फास्टर 10 to 100 times faster hobe holo laser technology ebong shekhane hocchilo ekbar ekti download korte hoto ekta ekta full cinema download korte 1 second er shomoy lagbe na tahole bujhun amader thank you thank you thank you lin thank you lin in the interest hi in the interest of time i think that it will be very difficult to have interpretation into various language it takes a lot of time just to interpret into png so uh, just to let you know Uh, you can speak English, and then David Bakal will have the opportunity to interpret in Pidgin. Thank you very much, Akram. Go ahead, David. Thank you, thank you, um, Lin. Yeah, just uh, just touching on what Akram is saying. Okay, you mean low PNG? I'm one of something Akram or Klo Tok Yeah, engineer Colin say I'm I'm been touching legally to us all of this laser technology. Laser technology, I'm I'm new plant technology. I'm this la technology you know got one plant company inside lot this la field blown uh, technology or IT only stop yet. Me plant lo on passive and first company long creating this la technology na I'm start long use him now. Work lo ready lo use him na go inside lo market ah. Or some na I'm work lo talk or some this la laser technology I'm I'm speed I'm fast more yet. So time you like login long uh, internet now nah, downloading or something. I'm sure like, technology. I'm by this time. I'm by going to long. So you miss I talk uh, fiber optics. Uh, fiber optics. I'm I'm me on plat or some uh, equipment where else I use him lot workload technology. But it's like laser technology. I'm by help him to so like, boost him speed. Ah, uh. I'm by making by speed them by go more yet now. Nah, but it's like information by go higher through or one map. I'm like go long. Eh. So I'm just like little gap explanation. Me me like uh, explain him lo you me lo here. Thank you, Lai Plala Harem. Thank you, Lin. Back to you. Thank you, David. I don't see any more hands raised, so I think we're going to wrap it up today. I know we covered a lot of new information, and as Tony said, don't worry, right, Tony? Give me a thumbs up, Tony. His point was that. Everything is done for you in on passive. This information that we provided to you was given to us. The topic was given to us by Ash Mofara because he wants us to learn it if we can. We do realize the topic was very technical today, so I want you to rest assured that you don't need to understand it all. Just listen, pick up what you can. If you learned a little bit. That is just great. That's all you need to know. All right. In fact, you don't even need to know this, but it's good for us to keep learning. It's the idea, right, of life. Life is about lifelong learning. So whatever we can gain in terms of new knowledge is a benefit to us. But remember, 
on passive system is very special. And this system is what? It's a done for you system, right? Everything is done for you. AI, artificial does it all for you. The work is done on our behalf. So don't fret, just enjoy learning new things and that's it. Go ahead, David, we'll let you interpret that or par paraphrase it. Thank you, Lynn. Okay, lo yimi lo PNG, yimi can la look saw eh, osem, when I'm something Lynn oklo talk na Collins engineer, yimi can talk talk, yimi explain him, osem, topic, this la topic, em CEO of lo yimi, es mufara, yimi select him na yimi give him long all engineers lo discuss him all long, long, yimi long discuss him inside long all webinars so that you may all got up by learning this last something out. On passive and not really company and pick up company. Now, no good you may fall fall. I'm going to talk about M1M kind of company. You may stop involved long M. Or some now all technology, a technical line only come long. Help him you may look how long. One M something and me stop inside long on passive. One M kind of walk and say go inside lot this la business or some technology business. Now, one M kind of product you may look long start long release him company release him. I'm helping you all get along. Look how long one M work but slow product. How does the product by work now? One of them customer by come now. Use him also like an old product. So, and big plot topic, techno, techno, uh, technical uh, topic. That's a long you know me. I'm long at least one of them something you can kiss him lo here. Lo this la meeting at least you saw well. One of them something work long come up inside the business or the company me block long stop inside long. Em. So, you know me, no need lo saw well. All get something lo this la company, but. At least you know me, me like can kiss him legally. Now you can look how some this like kind big like company. You know me, or some founder and me to block partner in charge of this like big like company. So you know me, me like can some sign up or some you me to you me prouder or some me to block founder of this like big like company. Time and loans. Then all man by come all by ask him, all by looking namely or some one block founder on passive. Me talk him you all man by pining me. Also I talk a CEO and me talk or some you know me all by all man by hunting you me. All by hunting you mean instead of you me go and hunt him all man or some all member blow you mean knock knock or don't wait stop here. Now I'm all here all back on the pine mean all by hunting me down. So it's like business, I'm no big business. All right, David. I'm like this him name blue and name blue back on his back. Big blood or in Chelon, country blue in a low world. Thank you, Lynn. All right, thank you very much. Uh, we lost you the last minute of what you said, David, just so you know, but we got most of it. I think we'll, okay. we'll go ahead and, yeah, yes, about go ahead. the last minute, the last minute, if you wanna repeat the last minute of what you said. Yes. Okay, um, one of something me o'clock talk talk long em. This la company you mean stop long em. You know me or some founder. Me to plan no need lo sell lo planty something em technical too much. Work lo me to plan em me to plan pay registration fee finish na or some bossman em itoka. Then this la company em by bring him name lo you by come up more inside long country na inside long world. All man no sell lo you now yeah. Then ball sell lo you now all by pining you. Now you me oklo go na hunt him down na all member lo you me na try lo kiss him alvim long all. Then now. Also, the line all about finding you now, all about hunting you down. So, you founder, you must proud of him. You partner, Lord Isla. Partner, Lord CEO, in charge, Lord Isla, big black company on passive. Thank you, Lynn. Thank you, David. All right, we're going to wrap up. Thank you. We're going to wrap up now with Tony Monk as our last speaker. We've been here for over two hours now, so this is a good time to end. Go ahead and take the floor, Tony. Thank you so much, Lynn. I appreciate it. And thank you for running this webinar. You, you did an incredible, incredible job. Uh, I want to speak to the Papua New Guinea people behind you, David. Um, Papua New Guinea people there, uh, you're you lovely people, seriously. Uh, I, I, I know that you guys go through a lot of struggles in, uh, in your country. I, I want you to remember something. David is a fantastic, fantastic leader. I trust him with all my heart. He is connected to OnPassive. He is connected to the CEO of this business. This is the biggest company 
it's going to be one of the biggest companies, if not the biggest company on the planet. Okay, so get with your leader, David, and get in as, a, as, as founding members because your lives are about to change very, very soon here to the better. Okay, so you'll never have to struggle again. You'll be able to change your country. Vote for David. Uh, he is a beautiful man with a huge heart, and uh, he knows exactly where he's going to be taking you, and that's to the promised land. Okay, so stick, stick with your brother, David. He knows what he's doing. And thank you so much for having me here today, Lynn. It was great uh, co-hosting this with you and Gladys. And thank you so much, Collins, for your input, uh, your intelligence. Uh, we know that you sacrifice your time and effort to be here. It's like, what, five, six o'clock in the morning there. It's very early. You got up very early just to be here to give us the information uh, of what goes behind the scenes of putting this all together. It's absolutely amazing. We love all of you guys. Thank you so much, Len. Back to you. Thank you. Thank you, Tony. Collins, I want to give you the floor. If you have any parting words, Collins. Yes, yeah, so thank, thank you, Lynn. I just want to thank David and the uh, PNG people. You guys are amazing. You know, it's not really easy. We know, again, today, like the topic, um, the topic we chose, uh, Mr. Asmo, my father chose for us, we already know that it will be a difficult one and how to break it down in a way that, you know, the common people will understand. But there are words that we cannot really change. You know, there are things that no matter how you break it, it's still a little bit technical. But thank God that, you know, those who can get it, of course, as Tony said, you don't really need to know all of these things. You don't, you don't, don't even bother about what we are doing. It's just what is running behind the scene. The, the method they are using to do the job and build the software. And even when you go to your login screen, you say, oh, this screen is beautiful. It's just what they are doing. So Mr. Ashmofara thought it wise. He said, okay, can you guys go out and really make people understand that this is what, this is the difficulties and this is the challenges, the process that we are going in. So you say we trust the process, but it's still part of the process. So we said, okay, let's just come and, you know, just say something small to the founders, not too much. Because if we want to break this, you know, in the beginning, I said, going through the process from start to finish, I'm telling you, maybe a month will take us here because it's a lot, lot to take in. But we try to simplify it. And no matter how you do, it's still a little bit tricky. But again, we just hope that you guys enjoy it. And, and that's what is going on. So on passive is great. And as Ash Mufara said, we should get ready for the greatest shape is because what they are doing is really great. Those guys in Hyderabad are not really sleeping. Honestly, they, are, they have sacrificed their lives. They are everything just for us. So we just have to be grateful. Thank you. Thank you, Collins. And if you don't mind, David, would you in paraphrase what Tony Monk just said and what Collins said? Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Lynn. Yes, uh, Tony, um, Tony, I'm here. I'm talking to you online, the backside here, all the backside of me. I'm talking to all Papua New Guinea. This is business, I'm one plug business, I'm a CEO, I'm making business, I'm simple, you know, you know, hard. I'm a technology company, I'm hard, low side, low technology, that's all long. You me, I'm making simple, so you know me, or some simple man, Mary can enjoy him. This la benefit of la company. So Emmy Oklo talk or sem. You know got one plug kind company and one kind of sem on passive, on passive and one plug big plug company and talk big plug inside long ground time Emmy launch. Or sem na life blow you or sem Papua New Guinea you missed up lo here. Life blow you, but you don't have struggle more. Time company launch now you or sem founder. Life blow you by send is inside long this la this la company. Lo short plug time to all. Also, I'm talking to them. You, na me, me to play privilege lost up. Na inside lots la big play company where you me enjoy him long em. Na Colin, I'm me come in. Na I'm me talk talk long side long technology. I'm me summarize him that's all. Na I'm talking to them. Planting something I'm me share him lo here or them lo help him you na me lo look so way long. Want him something. Want him can walk. I'm me stop inside long walk long technology or company ya. All big plus big plus technology company where you me looking all this stuff. Or some plenty work is I go inside long M. Now come up with more product 
na all man say enjoy him tasol product tasol baksat blanga mi got big plow clock say come up so long you na me instead long on passive you me to plot or some founder you join me some founder you me privilege long stop inside lot like big plot company and one plot company where m m by change him m or some come up some up like revolution inside lot is like ground or some na you na me me to plot can how much tasol na proud tasol or some me to plot founder so thank you lot is like one can uh Long this land, I mean, like talk Papua New Guinea on passive and one plus business, and by helping this like economy plus like country. You know, me also founder time me to plus start like kissing benefit, but you me long all uh, you me talk long pigeon, you me talk long money, money, now you me talk long talk plus long CP young rule, or you are now me plus long uh, plus long me long cap me plus through uh, beside me plus a talk wow. So one one. How you say call him money long em? Time you kiss him this la. Time on passive em start lo launch. Now you kiss him and by helping you lo send him life to you forever. Or same now me like encourage him you. This la legally got time to sell. You me got inside long two plus weeky stop. Number 22 day long moon December. This la founder position em, uh, moon June, sorry. 22 day long moon June. This is the founder position and by penis now and by close now no got more this is the kind of opportunity but come up low you so suppose you man long give him something man will help him online now you like stop inside law this law business law help him this law walk long get up him sit down blow man or marry me encourage him you long join him this law business so 400 kina tasol long you mean long papa new guinea currency law you join him so you can look him and me invite him you lot this meeting. Now you sit down, now you look, look long him. You can look him all. Now all can help him you lot join him this lab business. One time you meet or some all founders. Thank you, Lynn. I will pass it back to you and we can close it off. Thank you for your final words, David. At this time, we would like to thank the people that made this webinar possible. First of all, we want to thank Marty who opens up this webinar and takes the time to live stream and record it. We also want to thank Collins from the OTech Pros. He represented the group today and did a really good job of explaining a very complex topic. We also want to thank our co-hosts, Gladys Nilboro and Tony Monk for helping make this webinar run smoothly. We appreciate you so much. And we want to thank David Bacal, who is a very strong leader of PNG and his leaders, as well as the people of PNG who are here today to attend this webinar. And we also want to thank our international community, our international community who comes to this webinar to support the PNG people. We give you a lot of kudos for your support. We know that some of you are coming at midnight when you would normally be sleeping and you take the time to come to this webinar. So we appreciate and love all of you. Remember that the PNG webinar is held every Sunday at midnight. Please join us every week we will make sure we have a topic that's of interest and value to each and every one of you. Thank you all. And I'm going to unmute everybody and take it to the gallery so everyone can say bye-bye to one another. Bye-bye. Bye-bye, Lynn. Bye-bye, Tony. Bye-bye. Everybody. Bye-bye. Bye. Bye. Canada.